since I shoot a lot of fashion and things of that nature, I wanted to do a series that focused on the people behind the scenes. Because these people I find very interesting. I find them all in their own way, very beautiful mm -hmm. and interesting people and, I, and they're worth looking at. It's also my way of kind of saying thank you. My role, I think, is to bring the lighter side of things. There's so much heavy imagery going on right now, so I try to keep my stuff light, and that's where I try to keep my focus. I use that same approach when I teach. I tell them I can teach them as much as I can that's written in a textbook and what's in my head, but unless they go out and practice it, they're never gonna actually learn it. I've been involved with Olympus since 2009. I met them through U University of the Arts. I grew up in the military, right. so we did a lot of moving. I like European art a lot. I like European photography, and I guess that's also because I grew up there, and then that never left me when I came back to, to the U.S. I like skulls and dragons. Skulls and dragons? <laughs> yes. So I'm a little bit of a nerd. <laughs> I just think that stuff's cool. I'm, I, I'm kind of weird like that. You gotta keep keep hustling. Never mm -hmm. never give up. Mm -hmm. um, if it's your passion, do it. I'm still climbing, so right. I'm I'm not even there yet. Right.